Today we have with us Chris Gettin. Hey, Chris. Hi, nice to meet you. How's it going? Likewise. I'm so glad to see you here. Um, Chris, there are so many people who want to reduce fat and gain muscles at the same time. So what would you suggest for them? Um, get ready for a world of pain. <laughs> uh, no, it, it, it's, it's very simplistic. You know, you look after what you eat right. and making sure that you're assimilating the right clean foods, right. not the typical Indian foods. Uh, and what do you mean by typical Indian? Well, anything that's covered in ghee or, you know, oil. Or, we love ghee. Yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> so, you know, I have Indianized some, some foods myself, right. uh, but making sure that you're eating clean, eating for some form of protein, along with your vegetables, your carbohydrates with every meal, but right. being consistent with your cardio. Sure. And doesn't matter if you're female, weight training for about four or five times a week. Okay. You know, only for about 45 minutes each session. Um, you must have heard this in India, I think more often that, you know, women should not do weightlifting. Yeah. So what do you have to say about that? And I'm sure your answer is going to inspire a lot of women out here. Um, well, it, it's, it's an old wives tale. You know, um, I used to look up to the cardio area and think, God, look at all those women up there. If only they knew they were down here with us right. working out, they wouldn't have to spend hour upon hour upon hour up there. Right. So what you have to think is that, number one, women don't have the testosterone to build the muscle as we right. do. Bulky, yeah, huge. And it's not going to happen overnight. That's right. like me saying, hey, I'm going to be like Arnold. Well, right. no, it's not going to happen. It's like, you know, if you pick up a golf club, you're not going to start playing like Tiger sure. Woods. Um, but what I do say is that if you want the curves and the density in the right places, all you have to do is build up that muscle within the gym. Right. And you kind of stop when you think, okay, that's enough. You will get the curves in the right areas and you'll burn the fat in the right areas. Right. But not just that time as you would when you're doing cardio. You only burn off that fat for like 20 or 30 minutes. Right. But if you have the muscle density there, which requires more calories, you're burning off fat just sat in your bum 24 seven, <laughs> you know, so it just makes sense. Right. What are some of the tips that you'd like to give to the people who have started working out or who are in, into weightlifting? Be prepared to fail, okay? Right. So if you're not prepared to fail, you are gonna fail. So, you know, you have to be prepared for the uneventualities of uh, you know, social gatherings, mm -hmm being delayed on flights and, you know, feeling times that you're going to feel sick and you don't want to eat. You have to be, be, be prepared for all of these things. Uh, so anybody can get through an easy work week because you're in a schedule. So the weekends, everything goes a little bit haphazard. Right. So be prepared for those, uh, for those times. Uh, so some people say, is this 70% diet and 30% uh, weight training? No, right. it's 100% everything. If you're not doing the weight training and you're doing the cardio, if you're doing the cardio and you're not eating right, just think of like a three-legged stool. Right. If one of those, uh, you know, the legs are a little bit short, it's going to fall over. There's no foundation. So it has to work in a synergistic effect. You utilize the cardio to burn off the fat. You utilize the weight training to build the muscle to maintain uh, the calorie consumption that you're going to eat through the food. And when you're eating the food, it's got to be clean so you can perform better, so you have more energy, so you can recover. And my last question is that what is your stay wow mantra? How do you stay wow in your life? Stay wow. <laughs> um, again, everything's in balance, but it's going to get my, my workout fix in the morning. Okay. Now, whether that's to go and hit the gym or whether that's to go for a, a run, right. um, that gives me my double A batteries for the day to attack the day. I got a, I got a busy schedule hmm. and I'm not going to do it if I sit in my ass and think, oh, I'll, I'll hit the snooze alarm right. or anything like that, you know? So that's, that's my mantra. That much, that's what me. No, that's great. Stay well with Sapna.